Hey guys, in this video, we're going to learn where to find your forms in Smartsheet and how to create a form within Smartsheet. All right, let's dive in. All right, let's begin. We're going to go ahead and start with the ribbon on the left. We're going to go to this plus sign here and click here. We're going over here to the top right where it says create new and we're going to click forms. That's going to ask us to give our form a name. So I'll just call it form ABC. Click OK. And it's going to take us to the sheet. And the reason it's taking us to the sheet and not the form is all forms need to feed into a sheet. All right, so it's going to show your sheet here, but we're not going to worry about our sheet right now. One thing to keep in mind, see how it says form field one, form field two, and form date field. That will make a little more sense here in just a couple minutes. All right, to go to our forms, we're gonna click on forms right here on the top left. We're gonna click create form. And the form field one, form field two, and form date field, notice that those column names are also right here. That's because every field in a form is the column in a sheet. All right, I always like to start with the header. So we're going to click on header. We're going to drag it in. We can drag and drop the header wherever we'd like. I'm going to put it here at the top. And then we can give our header a name. I'll call it your in formation. And you can put in help text right here down at the bottom. Please fill out. Blah, 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 blah. All right. So we got some fields here. Maybe we want to change this name. We don't want to call it form field one. So I'm going to click on it. I'm going to go over here to label and I'm going to call it, let's say your name. That's one of the questions I want on the form. The next question is maybe I want um, asking for the date. So I'm going to click on form field two and I'm going to actually go up here to field settings or the same as column settings, exact same thing. I'm going to click here in the top right and I'm going to change this to a date. Click OK. And maybe I want to add a field in here that's not showing up here. On the top left, I'm going to click New Field. It's going to give me all these options. And maybe I want to do a drop down. Options are yes or no. Click OK. And then I'm going to drag and drop the one I just created right here. And you can make it vertical radio buttons, horizontal radio buttons, so on and so forth. All right, so let's say you've created your form on the top right. Make sure you click Save. And let's go to our sheet. And so as you notice, the forms that we've updated already show up right here. Hey guys, real quick, if you're finding this helpful so far, I've actually created a free user guide. It's a PDF that will be sent right to your inbox that gives you the top 32 functions that are the most successful within Smartsheet. I tell you what they are, I show you a brief description how to use them, and what instances to use them for. Again, it's a free PDF guide, it's one sheet, it's all yours, I created it just for you. Just click in the bio below and it's yours. Alright, let's get back to this video. All right, so if we go over here to the folder section and maybe I click on uh, Bob's Lemonade and I click on Intake Sheet. This is a sheet and a form I've created earlier. Right here on the left, this highlighted folder, if I click on this, you notice now that the intake form for this sheet, Intake Sheet, appears right here. So I can just click on this form and I can fill it out. Again, this form is going to this sheet. So if I go to the sheet that I just created, form ABC, I click on this sheet. I click on manage forms. I can also find my forms this way as well under manage. So if you just simply click into it, it takes you to the form. And if you want to copy the URL link, you can click right here. And that is how you navigate with forms inside Smartsheet, and that's how you start creating a form within Smartsheet. I will see you tomorrow in how to um, get into more detail of updating fields and different things like that within your form. All right, you guys, take care and God bless.